Hi everyone, Daniel from Homegrown Australia. I thought I'd quickly share with you what I'm doing this morning. I've got a few projects on the go. Um, I'll just share this one for the moment. I'm in my little um, room. I'm for fortunate enough to have a little room to keep my brewing equipment and honey equipment and um, a few a few cooking things to either noisy or uh, produce a bit of heat. So um, in this little room, you know, I've got my little um, honey buckets and I've got um, some of the brewing equipment and I you know, do my bread making in the bread maker and have a fridge for fermentation. Um, but today what I'm just doing is some uh, semi-dried tomatoes. So this is the last, uh, we're coming to the end anyway, probably not the last, but coming to the end of the tomatoes, um, middle of March here in Victoria. And I just thought I'd share with you, I've got my Sunbeam uh, Food Lab dehydrator. And you can see here, I've got these small romas that we've cut in half and they've been on for about oh, two hours now and they're in that process of dehydrating. And, um, some of these smaller ones are coming along a bit faster. So I've got the timer set for about 10 hours, I think I had the timer for. Uh, so I've just gone over two hours and I've got it set for 45 degrees. So it gives you a bit of an idea of what's involved in that, so I'll just put that lid back on. So this is a six tray um, dehydrator. Um, sometimes I wish I had a larger one when I, I get going in earnest. Um, but yeah, we use it a lot for drying the apples. Um, I didn't dehydrate any tomatoes last year, um, but I have in previous years and um, yeah, we did a batch about two weeks ago and really enjoyed them. So um, really worthwhile doing. Um, I like putting them in some olive oil with a little bit of herbs like oregano, just mixing them up. Um, but as a number of people have pointed out, if you're going to put them in the fridge, you really need to mix a 50-50 um, canola oil with olive oil. Otherwise the olive oil um, goes hard. So, um, yeah, quite easy to do. I just wash the tomatoes, cut them in half, stick them on the tray and stick them in the dehydrator for probably about 10 hours. And that's all there really is to it. And we end up with uh, yummy semi-dried tomatoes. Um, the dehydrators come in various forms. There's a lot of round ones, um, some quite inexpensive, some a bit more expensive. So far I've been pretty happy with this one. Um, it's been doing the job. Cheers for now.